Hello guys, Sven here. I am going to show you how to use custom sounds on 3DS games like Mario, Legend of Zelda and other using some hacks. What you need is Fuber 2000 with VGM Stream Component, Yata Plus and 3DS Audio Reaper. I'm going to unzip this. And open it up. And open source file. And then find the sound file uh, that you got from extracted 3ds ROM. I'll go for Mario Kart 7. And extracted ROM file system. Sound. And there you go. The file format can be either .pc, .sar, or .pc, .grp, and I'll pick the menu one, and tick CWAV, save location, desktop, and then hit process file, and there you go. Open up Fubar 2000 and then drag this folder into here and then you can listen to the uh, to the sounds in this format so you know where to replace so I'm ready for this custom voice so this is the original voice on Mario Kart 7 Luigi. and this is the custom voice uh, that's from Super Mario Galaxy. And go to Yata Plus. If you if you try to convert from Microsoft Wave Sound to CTO Wave Sound, you'll see this message. It means you need CTO Wave Converter 32. I am not gonna share the download link to you because it is illegal. This the program tool is a property of Nintendo and is copyrighted. And no matter whether you have legally obtained or illegally downloaded somewhere, uh, just uh, Google it. So once you got that. And copy everything into Yata Plus folder. And there you go. And then drag the sound here. And then you can now use this big button. I'm gonna name custom voice and done. Open up hex editor. I'm using HXD. Now go to the first file, click search, go to, and then type the offset of the original file, but ignore the uh, prefix hexadecimal, it's 19d60, and you found the CWAV section, and go to the next one, select everything with control plus A, and you 
final length of this file it's 1bc8 and go to edit select block length 1bc8 and there you go and and the last one and do the same thing In, you need to find the difference between the original and custom sounds so go grab a calculator it can be found from start menu or charm bar this is the normal calculator so go to programmer hit hex not decimal and then type in the length of the original 1b c8 then you're gonna take away with the custom one so minus 1 5 b 0 and then equals and then you found the answer it's 5 f8 so click on the very end and then edit insert bytes and then type the answer from the calculator 5 f8 and then leave them as zeros and there you go you it's filled with bunch of zeros so copy every copy everything and then paste it here and there you go and then click save and that's from the other file so nope So you got this custom sound on this file. I'm gonna copy. And then and then paste. And I've done this part for CTGP7. I've done the laptop part, so off to 3DS. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna launch Homebrew Launcher with VHacks. Hey, here it is. Yahoo! And it works. Yahoo! And hope my tutorial helps and thanks for watching.